And here are Detroit Red Wings fans. Check out today's news update. Don't forget to subscribe and activate notifications for more Detroit Red Wings news and updates. Detroit Hockey Now's Red Wings Review Series is assessing every player who held a significant place in the fortunes of the 2022-23 Detroit Red Wings season. We'll be looking at the highs and lows they experienced during the recently completed campaign, as well as what the future holds for them in Detroit. Today, we feature forward Dominic Kubalik when you factor Kubalik's salary cap hit and 20-goal season. Kubalik was one of Steve Iserman's high-value free agent acquisitions last summer. Iserman and coaches hoped Kubalik would again be the player he was as a Chicago Blackhawks rookie in 2019-20 when he put up 30 goals and 46 points. He didn't reach 30 goals this season, but did finish with 45 points. He is a more well-rounded player than he was four seasons ago. The only negative of his season was his inconsistency on both sides of the puck. Like many gifted offensive players, Kubalik is a streaky scorer. He disappeared for games at a time. In fairness, aren't most scorers streaky? If you are a 20-goal scorer, it means you will be blanked in 60-plus games. That was true for Kubalik who did most of his offensive damage early. The Red Wings want him to be tighter defensively. As Derek Lalonde puts it, his fingerprints were on a few crucial goals against. But overall, the Red Wings were pleased with his production. They appreciate his skill package, which includes a quality shot, particularly when he is set up for a one-timer. What is your opinion on this topic? Please leave a comment and consider subscribing for more updates on the Detroit Red Wings.